This past Sunday, the Missourian published a story on how Tebbets may or may not be the population center of the United States. In the story, we discussed how projections could cause uh, difficulties in calculating the mean population center. In order to understand why, you need to know what a map projection is. Essentially, a map projection is taking a 3D globe or a sphere and attempting to put it on a two-dimensional plane. So, when you try and do that, there's going to be distortion no matter how you map it. Map projections is that each distorts at least one aspect of the real world, either the shape, the area, the distance, or the direction. The most common type of map, which you've probably seen with on Google Maps, is the Mercator projection. Here you can see that Africa and Greenland appear to be the same size, when in fact, Africa is 11 times the size of Greenland. In the Sanson Flamsteed map, you have, which is what the census uses, South America and Africa are pretty accurately represented, but the poles are very distorted. Over here is the Peters map, which is more accurate in the size of Africa relative to Europe and uh, America. However, it, if you are trying to get directions on this map, it's not going to be good at all. The researchers in Michigan used a globe for their calculations, therefore taking out all distortion that could be caused by using a map projection. Essentially, the best way of putting it is that if you were to move America anywhere else on the globe, you'd still get the same results, whereas if you projected it and moved the United States, it would be different everywhere you put it.